Hi everybody, my name is Right Worshipful Brother Robert H. Johnson. I am the managing editor over at the Midnight Freemasons, as well as the producer of the Whence Came You Masonic podcast. I am a member of Ezekiel Bates Lodge in Attleboro, Massachusetts, and I'm here today to teach you how to wear a bow tie. Step one is, you have to get a bow tie. What bow tie should you get? Well, I'm here to tell you that you should get this bow tie right here. This is the bow tie made exclusively for the Grand Lodge of Massachusetts. And what we want to do is teach you how to wear this bow tie and show you how you can help support widows, orphans, uh, and those less fortunate than us when times get rough. So let's show you how to wear this bow tie. So first things first, when we get this bow tie, we want to just undo the, the paper here. Great bow ties from Masonic Revival. A little plug for our brother Edgar Alejandro who made these for the Grand Lodge of Massachusetts. The bow tie itself is a wonderful material. Great silk material. Has the state of Massachusetts along with the lights on there. Great detail. And uh, when you open a bow tie, the first thing you notice is how long they are. Well, also when you open it, likely the, uh, the T bar in the back of the bow tie is not going to be attached so it'll be kind of loose and floating and you can move it around on the back of a bow tie are the markers so that you can actually put it to the specific length of your neck or the circumference of your neck so you want to make it about a half inch bigger maybe a quarter inch bigger than what you normally wear so i wear a 17 inch neck so i'll set mine for normally 17 and a half, but because I'm doing a video on how to teach it, I'm gonna need a little extra slack. So I'm gonna set mine for about 18 inches. And you just slide it in there and you pull it tight and it makes a nice tight clasp. And it's very nice and long. You can take a look at that there. Pop your collar so you have somewhere to put this thing. You're going to take a look at the label on your bow tie, Masonic Revival there. It's upright. That means when we tie our bow tie, the design will be upright also. We don't want to have upside down square and compasses in the state of Massachusetts, do we? No. So uh, we'll take the bow tie and we're going to wrap it just like that. And we're going to just drape it just over our chest like this. Now I'm a right hander. So you lefties just do the opposite. I take the left side of my bow tie and I bring it down about right there i bring this edge to right about where the flare on the other side starts just like that it's going to stay there this is going to be the business side of our bow tie this is what's going to come up like this and form our bow tie and make us look so handsome so we're going to take this side first and this is just like tying your shoes so you're going to wrap it over the front and you're going to tuck it up underneath and just pull it over like that and it's going to flap back here like that and you're going to let this one hang so we're good now we're halfway done really now we're just going to take this or we're just going to bring it up like that put our finger over and kind of center where we think it's going to be because this side folds over so it folds over that's what forms this tail of the bow tie so we'll we'll kind of fold it over like this and we want it somewhat in the middle and we're going to take the piece that we threw over our shoulder and we'll throw it back down over the top. Now, this next part took me forever to learn until a southern gentleman told me, you just gotta fold the taco. So that's what you do. You take this and you fold it like a taco, just in half. And when you do that, you'll pull the bottom down a little bit. And so now you have both halves of the front of your bow tie. And this is what's the back end of your bow tie. So what you're gonna do, and I'll turn sideways, you can see this. When I'm holding this this way, there's a little hole that we've made right in the knot, right there. And we'll turn this way so you can see it here. So what we wanna do, we're just gonna take this here and we're gonna fold it up and we're gonna push it through the opening that we've created. So once we do that, we've pushed our thumb through and the bow tie is on the other side, we can kind of let go. And that's really the, the hardest part about the bow tie. Now we're just going to sit here and we're going to play with the ends. We're going to be kind of 
pushing and pulling to make sure until we get to a point where we feel like the bow tie is looking good and fluffed and ready to go. We'll center it out a little bit. And that's it. So then we just put our collar down. Straighten our shirts out there. And we're good to go. And that's how you tie the bow tie. So I hope you guys all go to the Grand Lodge of Massachusetts website, pick up this bow tie and help out some people who are less fortunate than ourselves and make yourself look good in the process. So until next time, I hope you guys stay on the level. Take care.